Hey everybody, um, hope y'all are having a great day. Um, I'm having a pretty good day here. Um, today we're gonna do something a little different, a little out of the norm for the channel. Um, I'm actually gonna be reviewing a cell phone case. As some of you probably know, I do all my YouTube videos on my cell phone. Um, I have an iPhone X, it does shoot good videos, um, has a good quality camera. I, I'm satisfied with how they come out. But doing that and shooting the 1080p and stuff like that, um, drains your battery life and the pictures, you know, you shoot some pictures in like 4k and stuff and that storage and stuff. It just, it just drains the battery. So I was always constantly having to charge my phone. So I did a lot of research online and, uh, on cell phone cases and stuff. And wouldn't you know it, the heat pump comes on. Um, so I did a lot of research online and stuff like that. And there's not a ton of cases out there for the iPhone X. But the best case I found, and almost just unanimously on a lot of sites I looked at, said that this company called Lux um, had one of the best um, charging cases that you could actually get. And so I ordered one, and they're around $65, and it comes with a 3,000 milliamp battery life inside. Not battery life, 3,000 milliamp battery inside. Sorry, I dropped the case. Um, so now it's wet. But it comes in a case like this, and on the inside, it actually has some padding and your instruction manual and stuff like that. Then the, the actual case, you can see it's not crazy thick. It's got, a, it's got a thicker place here for the battery, but it's not crazy, crazy thick, and it, it's really soft rubber, as you can see here, it bends and flexes. And then it has the normal little um, iPhone jack right here. It plugs into the bottom of your iPhone. Now, as you can see here, it has the same iPhone connector in here for your charger. The cool thing about this case is that you can actually still use your headphones in this port. A lot of cases you cannot do that. Now I have a lot of wireless headphones, so I don't you know, plug my headphone in here. And even when I go jogging, a lot of times I'll use the earmuffs and now it's getting hotter, so I'll probably have to go to earbuds now. But I've been thinking about buying wireless earbuds too but currently my earbuds actually plug in here so i can still use that and if you don't have wireless headphones this might be a big plus for you because a lot of cases do not allow you to do that um, when you plug this up it actually charges your cell phone first it'll completely charge the cell phone and then it'll charge the 3000 milliamp battery in the case so you know you don't have to worry about charging the case and then charging the cell phone and having to turn on the case and stuff like that it'll actually charge your cell phone first and then charge the case. Um, when you put the cell phone in here, there are directions on how to do it right here. They do want you to bend this down and slide the cell phone in. Don't put it in at an angle and bend it down because I guess what they're saying is you'd probably break this little tab right here that charges it. So they want you to, to bend down the top and actually slide the cell phone in and then pop this back over it. Um, it does give you good protection here around the camera. I actually had this on my case the other day and or on my phone the other day and dropped my phone and it hit the tripod. Now it did crack my screensaver, which I do have a Zag screensaver on it. It is glass and it chipped the corner of it but didn't damage the phone at all. There's no damage on the screen or anything like that. Just the screensaver is the only thing that got damaged in that process. And like I said, it's glass. So if it hits something hard, it can chip that. But pretty, it's pretty well protected and it, it, it does have a good padding on the side. To, so if it does hit the ground, it will help protect the phone. What you do have to think about though, is when you add a battery to your phone like this, um, it will add some weight. Now I'm used to that extra weight now, but when I first got it, um, I could tell it was heavier. I mean, you're adding a, another 3000 milliamp battery to the back of the phone, so it's obviously gonna be heavier. Um, but that is something to keep in mind. My wife, I let her, her hold it and she was like, you know, it's, it's way too heavy for me. I wouldn't want one of those. Um, but for me and what I do on YouTube, it was perfect and I quickly got used to that weight. But I do want you to know that it does add a little bit of weight. It's not crazy heavy, but you will notice that. Um, the button right here on the back, as you can see right here, you hold that in and it comes on right there. Um, I don't know if you're supposed to turn it off and on like that, so I'm gonna turn it back off. But when your phone is plugged into it, you hold that in for two seconds, I think it said, and these four lights will come on and it'll start charging your phone. And then as it charges and this battery goes dead, each one of these lights will go out. Now, it says it gives you two and a half um, times the battery life as your normal iPhone X. And I'm not sure it gives you two and a half times from my experience. I'm just guessing it's probably about double the life 
which is plenty and it was totally worth the, the $65 it cost for this. Um, I think that's a reasonable amount of money for um, a cell phone case that does charging. I remember when these cases were, you know, over $100 easily, but um, I totally think this is worth $65 and double the battery life is totally worth that to me. Also, because now I'm not having to charge my phone throughout the day. And during live streams, I was trying to figure out how to plug up my phone because, you know, the iPhones come with a cord about this long. Well, they're not quite, but they're, they're very short. And if you don't have an outlet somewhere near you, it's really hard to get plugged up and be able to hook your phone up and stuff like that. So now I don't have to worry about that. Whenever I start a live stream, I just turn on the battery on this case and, uh, you know, I just set up my tripod and my live streams are going. I don't have to worry about my battery going dead. So, uh, so overall, I am very satisfied with this case. Lux seems to be a very good product. I've had it now, like I said, about a week and a half, maybe two weeks, and I've used it every day. I've actually had to charge my phone every single day from shooting videos to watching videos to, you know, just normal stuff on your cell phone, talking on it, surfing the net, stuff like that. So, you know, I've not had to charge my phone throughout the day like I would normally have to. One other thing I would like to say, I do have a wireless charger at work. And I would set my phone on that and let it charge so I didn't have to keep plugging it up and unplugging it. So I would just set on the wireless charger. Um, you cannot use your wireless charger with this case. Um, it will not charge. I tried that the other day and it wouldn't work. So uh, if, if you do use a wireless charger, just know that you cannot use the wireless charger with this case, which isn't a big deal to me because the case gives me enough juice to make it through the whole day anyway and I charge it every night. So I don't have to worry about that. But if that's a big deal to you, that might be something to think about. Um, I do recommend this case if you're having battery life issues. Um, they do sell them for more than just the iPhone X. I'm not sure um, about what all they have. I'll try to link their website in the bottom of the video if you have a different phone. You can go check that out. I'm sorry I didn't, didn't check that out prior to the video, but what my video was for was strictly the iPhone X because that's what I use. One other cool little thing is they do put a little X on the side of it. I thought that was kind of cool for the iPhone X. It does have a little X. So I thought that was kind of neat. It, it does show a little bit of wear, so I don't know how long it'll take before it's completely gone, but that was kind of a cool little touch. I do want to say the buttons right here are easy to push, um, a lot easier to push than the case I had on it prior to this, which was an Under Armour case. I love Under Armour. I use a lot of their shirts and shorts and stuff like that. So when I seen they had cell phone cases, that's what I got for my new phone. But this one is a lot easier to manipulate the buttons and stuff when you need to use your phone. So. I do like that a little better about this case as well. Um, I appreciate you watching this video. If you're in the market for a cell phone case with a, a battery charger on it, um, give Lux a, a chance, give them a look. Appreciate you watching the video. Um, Y'all have a great day and I'll see you next time.